good morning, Brookhaven. What a beautiful day. I mean, seriously, it is gorgeous outside. Let's go downstairs and let's talk to my brother. Oh my gosh, I love this guy so much. How you doing, George? And he just said, hey, bro. Yo, bro. Yeah, good to hear from him, man. You know, I gotta get to work. But if you want later on, let's hit the diner. You know, me and my bro love hitting the diner late at night. It's the best. The food is so good there. And my brother said, okay, bro, have a good day at work. Thanks, dude. And guys, he's just chilling here for now. All right, yeah, let's just get the heck out of here. And my bro just said, wait, oh, wait, what's going on? He said the news. Oh, what could be going on in the news today? Hello, Brookhaven. My name is Jay Boblo, your number one host for all Brookhaven breaking news. And in a crazy new developing story, we have noticed top scientists have pointed out a meteor that is going to be orbiting the earth the meteor is actually about to be reaching its closest point so everyone go outside and take a look at this thing <laughs> my brother just said uh he's literally hype here that's actually the coolest thing i've heard i've never been able to see a meteor he said like a shooting star that's hype yeah that's so cool well i guess i'll see it on the way to work all right all right bro let me know if there's any vibes yet take a pic for me of course dude I wonder if I could see that thing from here. I think I barely see it next to the sun. I'm not too sure. Whoa. And we are almost to work. Wow, Brookhaven is pretty empty right now. I'm not too sure what's going on. All right, let's get the heck in and old guy. I've seen this guy around actually. He just said the end is near. Uh, sir, can you please step away from the star brooks i don't want you to scare anybody away man it's just a it's just a meteor in the sky and he just said sir please believe me sir the end is near this old guy just said we will all be destroyed okay pal let's calm down seriously it, it's just something that's going to be orbiting the earth it's getting close but it's not that close all right let me just clock into work oh what's up janet how you doing said hey ready to start your shift yes totally all right let's get this day going man it's so weird there's legit no customers today i have no idea what's going on right now janet this is super odd and whoa the military's going around i wonder if there's a lot of people at like a viewing party of the comet or something janet said did you see that yeah i i i did that was really really interesting what the heck who the heck is this guy okay we have a customer perfect hey sir how are you he said hello one coffee please yep of course let me say coming right up oh this is my favorite job all right let me go over here let me mix it up in the machine and perfect and this guy just said y'all see the news oh oh yeah yeah no i did see the news i i did see the news yeah it was uh it was about the meteor coming near yeah it was crazy here you go sir enjoy the coffee just said actually yeah you should go watch the news again what the crap is he talking about janet that guy outside just said again the end is near what is happening right now no 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 no. like they said it was it's just coming close it's not gonna be a bad sign but that that army truck or that military truck was really creepy so what does that mean i'm not too sure um here let's let's clock out early all right let's just let's just kind of clock out we haven't had too many customers today let's just close up early let's close shop let's get back home janet that sounds good to me all right and and this guy again is just still standing out here such a creepy mysterious vibe he said please believe me I said to the wilderness i go Heck is he going? All right, I better get home. See my brother. All right, let's see what all the fuss is about. Yo, bro. Ah, see, watching Rags to Riches. Got it. And he said, yeah, you're back early. Yeah, uh, <laughs> weird day at work, to be honest. Someone came in and and told us to check the news again the first time we watched it it was actually completely different they telling us that now we need to tune back in my brother is saying you didn't just check from your phone all right let's change the channel let's see what the breaking news is all about all right let's tune in hello everyone my name is jay Pablo, and as you know in the last few hours we've gotten a very disturbing update that the comet is not going to be orbiting but actually has a 28 percent chance of hitting earth in one week exactly <laughs> One, one week? In this time, please do not panic. Please do not run to the stores. Everything is going to be fine. That's that's all they told me to read. Is everything gonna actually be... Cut, cut this off. Uh, let's turn that off real quick. My brother just said, we need to panic. What is going on right now, bro? The end of the world? No, 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 no. This can't be. It has a 28% chance of hitting. A 28% chance. That's not good at all that's actually really bad that's like almost an entire coin flip and my brother just said no, a military dr truck just drove by y yeah I, I i saw those earlier actually i saw those earlier there's a bunch of them he said close the blinds no no we need to hit the stores bro we need to hit the stores this is going to be bad food 
water. Oh my gosh, more and more trucks everywhere we go. He said, let's go now. All right, let's do this thing. All right, bro, let's get in there real quick. Hurry up. Okay, let's grab a cart. Let's just get some food. Okay, let's stock up. Uh, Doritos is a good one. Okay, we don't need any candy or anything. We need a lot of water right now here. Let's stock up on waters. We get a little bit of milk in there. The girl just said they're almost out of milk. Wait, where, where's the, wait, where's the cashier? Hey, bro, this is, stop it, lady. You're hitting me. Wait, where's the cashier? Wait, what the heck is going on? So I don't have time for this. She just bolted the crap out of here. Okay, I, I say we do the same thing. He just said she stole. Yeah, she did. And I think we're up next. All right, let's just get the heck out of, whoa. Uh, uh, sir, sir, we are no, we are no problem. Please, there's plenty of food still. Please, we're early. So give me all of it. Okay, okay, take it. Take the cart, take the cart. I don't need it. Okay, oh, let's get the crap out of here. Hurry, bro. Good morning, Brookhaven. In the last 24 hours, it has been a completely different change. And of course, the world looks great. It's Everything's looking amazing. But there's one thing that I've noticed. You see that thing? It's getting bigger and closer. Let's just go downstairs. Let's talk to my brother. Let's see how he's handling all this situation. Yo, bro, is everything good? He looks really stressed right now. He's sad. He just said no channels work all dead. Oh my gosh, that's not good. No, no cable? At least we still have power. At least, let me check the water supply. Yeah, we should be good on that. Yeah, we're good. We're gonna be fine. Everything is still working good. The, the government is, is, is totally in lock right now. I think I'm going to head to work. Like nothing has happened. Like no, nothing has happened. Like we are totally good. He just said, poke, please be careful. I will be, don't worry. All right, I'm gonna head to work and I'm gonna just see if everything is still as normal as it could be. All right, just gonna pretend everything is normal. Just gonna head to work and no way, Janet is actually here. Okay, my life is not that ruined, okay? The world is still going. She just said, hey, hey, Janet, good to hear from you. I just see, she's not obviously her face. She's really not taking this well. So let me just say, how are you handling all of this? You know, this is a very stressful time and you know, it's good thing that we're still working. The world is good. Look at it. everything looks nice. Nothing is too bad. I mean, the streets are a little bit emptier than usual, but it's not that big of a deal. She said, well, I think everything will be okay, but said, my parents are stressing. Yeah, my brother is not taking this well at all all like seriously not going well but we must continue to work and grind you know the grind never ends until the world stops turning so we might as well just serve these drinks all righty yeah Ugh, it's just been so long has anyone even come in here hello like what is going on she just said not a single customer i mean it, it does make sense i mean it it does make sense it, it really does you know there's a big scare going on in the world everyone wants to be with their family inside i think maybe we are just kind of you know misunderstanding how people are reacting i think it'll be just fine she just said one sec and oh she's getting a call right now okay i'll let her handle that i'll just kind of scroll through my phone real quick let's just see what the news is saying <sighs> interesting a lot of the Brookhaven Twitter community is noting that noting this. Oh, and she just got off the phone right now and she just said, My parents' place is getting robbed. I gotta go. Oh snap. People are burglarizing places already? At the end of the world comes scarcity. I better make sure my house is okay. Right, let's just get home. George, you okay, buddy? And my brother is over here on his phone right now and he just said, Why? And then he saw me. He said, poke. Yo, bro. He just said right now, I have no service. Literally none. Holy crap. It's coming up as no bars either. And he just said, I can't get anything to load. Me neither. But I got some bad news. My coworker's home was just raided by criminals. He said, raided? Yeah. We need to be careful. My brother said, what's happening to Brookhaven? I'm not sure. What the heck was that? Stay back. St st stay back. I'll, I'll, I'll answer it. Stay back. Oh, crap. I think it's that guy from earlier. Holy crap. Sir, please! He said freeze! Sir, please, 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 don't do anything, please! Give me all your money now! Okay, just uh, follow me. Follow me. It's fine. Here, we're just gonna get, get to the money. We're gonna be okay. Uh, it's up here. Just just take the elevator. Okay, it's, it's, it's over here in the safe right now, even though money may not even matter that much. Okay, it's just in here, sir. It's just in here. What's my brother doing? Whoa! Oh my god, my bro just got him! Nice hit, man! Holy crap! We're taking that off his hands. Holy crap, dude. Nice work, man. He will not be coming back. What a crazy day so far. We need a barricade. Well, everybody, we're here and it is day three. This is getting very bad. I, at this point, want to look outside and see how big the meteor could be. But at this point, I think we just need to lay low for the entire rest of the week. My brother's looking outside right now. He's trying to check out all the vibes. How's it looking out there, man? We've been starting to hear some bad noises outside at night. It's starting to really become a martial law out here where everything is kind of, you know, just 
up for grabs. He said it's going down out there for real. Okay, here, get, get, get back down here. Okay, get back down. We just got to be careful. We don't want anyone to see us. Luckily, we still have power and water. I mean, this is probably the biggest blessing ever, but our food supply is running low and it's time for us to go out. But since I have the weapon here, I am going to go out alone. Okay, let me tell him right now. It's going to be okay. I'm going out alone. All right, I'm going out alone. And he just said, no, it's going to be okay, bro. I promise. And he just said, it's too risky. I can do this, okay? I promise you, I could do this. He said, you're my little bro. I can't let you go. We need food. I'll be back. I have to do this for me and my brother, man. And luckily, this door is already broken. So we just need to kind of slide through this. He just said, okay, be quick. All right, sounds good. Holy crap. That does not look good. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. All right, guys, we are going and approaching into the city. We have our weapon, but we need to be very careful. And the grocery store is completely done for. So luckily, I have been very smart, and I've been hiding some Starbrooks bakery items in a stowaway cabinet. And hopefully, this will be enough. Let me grab these things right here. Okay, absolutely perfect. We have so many things to bring back home. Let's just slowly... <sighs> There's cars everywhere. Okay, gotta lay low, gotta lay low, gotta lay low. They cannot see me. Special forces everywhere. Okay, I gotta go through the back door. Way too risky. All right, let's just get back over here. We're going home. All right. Whew, we made it. Brother? Brother? Uh, where the crap is this man? Oh my god, where is he? Bro! Okay, maybe he stopped outside to get some fresh air. Maybe he went to go see the meteor. Maybe he went to... No, 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 no. This is not good, man. This is not good at all. Where is he? I need to go look out for him. Oh god, jeez. Oh god, jeez, they're everywhere. What are they planning? What are they doing? I guess I better lay low and just wait for him to come back. All right, everybody. It is officially the fourth day. That means in three days, the world is forever ending, or at least it's a percentage chance. And as you guys can see, I legit cannot use the elevator because there is no more power in my home. So the only way to get down is to literally go down from here and go up through the air. It's the most impossible thing. All my food has gone bad. The only thing that works now is water. That is the last thing, which thank goodness, right? Like that's what I need to survive. But I miss my brother. He hasn't come back. Nothing but pure static on every single channel. And it's all getting worse. Every night I hear more and more shots. Let me just go over through here. The infamous hole to see everything through. Oh my God, as you guys just saw that, there's cars everywhere. Oh, what the crap? I haven't heard anything like that. Again, I'm just gonna have to lay low, relax, calm down. And hopefully my brother will come back soon. But if there's, oh my God, the bank. Oh, this is a nightmare. The city's getting destroyed as I know it. All right, it is the next day and I am prepared to go and get my food. I am starving right now. And in the last day, this city has been taking the most tremendous toll I've ever seen. Take a look at that thing in the sky, man. As you can see, martial law has broken out. Explosions everywhere. Cars everywhere. Holy crap, they're legit everywhere, man. Oh my God, man. What an absolute nightmare. Oh my God, they're here. No, don't hurt me. I will shoot. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait. Janet? What happened to you? You're you are a, a bandit now. I said, look at the world poke. It's over. I said our job is over. This is all that's left. This is all that's left. We need to make the best of it. But looting and scaring people, I mean, I I, I get it. I, I get it. You have to survive out here. I, I totally understand. What what's your plan? And I can even ask her right now. Also. Have you seen my brother around? Man, I miss that guy so much. But apparently, in the wilderness, there is word of a bunker. And she said about my brother, I haven't heard or seen him. Okay, it was worth a shot. But that bunker does sound interesting. Oh, God. They're getting closer. So we need to move. Go, hurry, let's go. All right, Janet, this is my home. I know it's not much, but at least we have each other, right? Like, I mean, at least I, at least I have someone to talk to. She said, not bad. Yeah, no, it, it yeah, it's not it's not bad at all. And I have water. Literally unlimited water still. Like that's that's like the best part. Take a look at this. Ready? Let there be water. She said, good, good. We can just kind of see what happens. I mean, hopefully you have a little bit of food that can kind of help pull us over. And she just said, I'm gonna keep watch. Yeah, yeah, uh, sure. Sounds sounds like a plan. Okay, yeah, she's just kind of watching out the door right now. Okay. In the meantime, I guess I'll just see if there's any new TV on at all. Come on, it's gotta be something. You're black. Nothing at all. Yeah, Janet, you don't need to keep watching. You you may you may actually like attract like people. Oh, whoa! Who the crap are who are these guys? Janet! Uh hello! Are you are you gonna Janet just said I'm sorry, Poke. Wait, 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 wait. But 
we're, we're co-workers. She said, sorry, this is the new world order. And all of them are saying this place is pretty nice. They're saying jokes on you. You, you led them here and you, you, you work with them. You, you work with the criminals. He said, don't move. I won't, but I will look at her and I'll tell her how disappointed I am in you. I, I, I can't believe you. You would do this? He said, a girl's gotta live. I can't believe this. This is a disaster. All right, everybody, it is officially day six. And as you, if you could tell from how if you can barely see how sunny it is outside, but they have been keeping watch on me the entire time. And, the, and this guy just said, ha, ha, ha. And he, said, he said, I know you have food storage. Where is it? I don't like I've been telling you. I've been telling them for so long. I don't have any more food here. They're literally going nuts over it. They said, or I'll eat you. Uh, Please, please don't. I don't have any hidden food or else I would have eaten it. Like, come on, be real. Be so real right now. Now he's pointing a gun at him and he just said, you. He said, I know you have food. Oh my gosh, they're going insane. They are legit becoming like cavemen right now. And I saw you sneaking snacks. Yes. And Janet just said, stop. Everybody, please, let's relax. And he's looking at her now and he's pointing the gun. He said, this is all your fault. The meteor is coming. He said, I need to see it. Uh, is your friend okay, Janet? Oh my God, he's shooting up this house, man. He just said, I want to see it too. He said, you know, I'm curious myself. Don't look. You don't want to see that meteor. It's going to tweak you out. But now I'm getting curious. Now I need to see what this thing is looking like. So I need to see. You know what? I need to look at it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That thing is crazy. Oh my gosh. I think he's going to fall over. He just passed out from looking at it. And Janet's running away. This guy just said, we're dead. I'm leaving. There's only one place for me to really go now. The wilderness. It's where that crazy guy was talking. And maybe my brother ended up going there. I know he loves just watching all this stuff and seeing everything. That's our last bet. 